Hi guys, today I'm going to show you some F12 algorithms. Now, I know most of you use Intuitive F12 and Intuitive F12 is a really efficient way for solving F12, uh, but I still think that uh, every Intuitive F12 user should know some F12 algorithms. Now, if you're a more advanced cuber, so if you're like sub-15 or faster, uh, then you probably already know most of these algorithms. Uh, but if but if you're uh, not so advanced, then I think you will find this video very helpful. So I hope you I hope you can improve your F two L with these algorithms. Okay, let's get right to it. This is definitely one of the most important F2L algorithms that you should know. So, intuitive F2L users have various ways of solving uh, this case, but um, you really can't solve this uh, very efficiently uh, with intuitive F2L. So, here's an algorithm. F2, U2, R prime, F2, R, U2, F, u prime f now if you want to solve that case in as few moves as possible then uh that's definitely the right algorithm for you but i actually prefer uh in another way of uh, solving this case this is not really an algorithm it's more of an intuitive way of solving this but just in kind of a smarter way so let me show you so first i do r u prime r prime so then i have both of these pieces here in the top layer then i do lowercase d and now i can match up these two pieces and then i just insert the f12 pair next we have this case so here the edge is solved and the corner is in the right place but it's twisted clockwise so the white sticker is facing towards you. Uh, so in this case, we use this algorithm. So R, U, R prime, U prime. So we do the sexy move first. And then you solve this case uh, the way you would usually solve it. Uh, if you don't know how to solve uh, this case, uh, then this is how it goes. R, U2, R prime, U prime. And then you just insert this with r u r prime and then this case is just an inverse of that so here the corner is twisted uh, counterclockwise uh, so the white sticker is facing to the right so here we use this algorithm r u prime r prime so that's how we get both of these pieces in the top layer and then you pretty much uh, solve this the way you would usually solve it so u r u2 r prime u r u prime r prime so you probably know this already uh, but for any f12 beginners out there watching right now this is a really good algorithm so in this case you have the edge solved and the corner is right here above the edge and um, as you can see uh, these two colors on the right side match up and um, the the white sticker is in the top right of the front face so this is the algorithm you use to solve this case u prime r u prime r prime u2 r u prime r prime all right this is just a mirror of the previous case so um, yeah everything is mirrored uh, you have these two colors matched up on the left side uh, this time and uh, the white sticker is in the top left of the front face so you do this algorithm u l prime u l u2 l prime u l right so these next two cases are the same as the last two cases uh but these but this edge is flipped uh so here's the first case and in this case you hold the cube like this and then you do a lowercase d prime and then l u l prime 
lowercase d and then you just insert this with l prime u prime l and then the mirror you hold the cube like this and then you do uh, lowercase d um, r prime u prime r lowercase d prime and then you just insert it so r u r prime now you may think you know this case already but all those u moves and y rotations can actually uh, be turned into lowercase d moves uh, so here is the algorithm for this case uh, so lowercase d r prime u2 r lowercase d prime r u r prime so yeah you insert that at the end and then we have the mirror of that case uh, so it's pointing towards the left and um, the white sticker is pointing towards the left and uh, you do lowercase d prime um, l u2 l prime uh, lowercase d and then you just insert this l prime u prime l alright this is definitely one of the nastiest f2 l cases I have ever seen I totally hate this case um, so you will be very thankful for this algorithm so here it goes r u prime r u then you do a y rotation then you do r to pair this up and then you finish it off with u prime r prime f2 and then we have the mirror of that uh, and in this case instead of the matching colors being here uh, they are here and the algorithm for that is r u prime r prime f prime l prime u2 l f okay guys those were 12 f2l algorithms i hope you learned something new from this and i hope it, it will help you become faster hey are you thinking about switching from two look oll to one look oll check out my easy oll cases uh video and you can learn nine of the easiest oll cases in just a few minutes uh, by the way guys, I will be making more videos on easy OLL cases and even more videos on uh, important actual algorithms that you need to learn to become faster. So um, yeah, look forward to that. Uh, those videos uh, will be uploaded uh, during season 4 and season 5. I still have uh, to upload two videos for season 3. I'm not gonna tell you what they are. Let that be a surprise. Um, but um, yeah guys, I will see you in my next video.